What's up everybody, Raider XP here. Today I'm going to show you how to make a simple automatic shulker loader. These are the materials you're going to need. Go ahead and pause your video so you can gather up what you need. This is a dispenser by the way, sorry. I'm using a Dwarven themed add-on to my game at the moment so things might look a little different for you. Alright, let's go ahead and get this thing done. First thing we're going to want to do so we're going to want to place a double chest just like so. Come around behind and crouch down. Place you a hopper just like that. Now grab your block of choice. It can be anything at all. And place two sets, three sets of blocks too high just like so. Next thing you want to do. Grab you your comparator, place it right on that block facing away from the hopper, just like so. Then we're going to grab our dispenser. And we're going to place our dispenser right there. Isn't that cool looking dispenser? I love this, this add-on. It's super cool. Then what you're going to do is going to crouch down. You're going to place a hopper right on top of that dispenser. Grab your chest, crouch down, place a double chest right on top of that hopper like so. All right. Now what we're going to do, we're going to grab our block and we're going to place, crouch down and place a block right there next to that chest. Grab your piston. All right, now come down underneath here like so and grab your piston, place your piston facing downward, just like that, and then you can go ahead and break out that block there. Place a temporary block underneath that piston, and grab your hoppers, and place your hopper facing into that block. Now, as you can see here, I use an add-on called directional hoppers, and that shows me exactly which way my hopper is pointing, so I never get confused whatsoever. It's really handy little add-on. Go ahead and break that temporary block. Grab your glass and crouch down and place two pieces of glass on top of that chest, just like so. Okay, now what we're going to do is we're going to come around to the behind here, and we're going to grab our block. I'm going to place two blocks, just like so. Place your redstone torch layer and your redstone dust right there, just like that. Next thing we want to do is we're going to place three blocks, just like that, and one block right next to that piston there. Grab your glass. Place your glass, just like that. Now we're going to grab our redstone dust, and we're going to place our redstone dust going all the way up, and that's going to power that piston just like so. Grab your block again and we're going to come over here and we're going to place three blocks out, two more blocks forward and one right there. Grab your redstone dust and place three redstone dust in a line just like that. Then grab your redstone repeater Place that right there and place that on four ticks all the way, just like you see. Then finish it off with your redstone, and that'll power the dispenser there. Grab your button, crouch down, and place your button right there on that dispenser, just like so. And then lastly, what we're going to do is we're going to come over here to this hopper, crouch down, and we're going to place a double chest right on top of that hopper. And that's pretty much how we're going to make this build. Next thing you want to do, grab you some shulkers. At this point in your game you probably have gotten quite a bit of them or you've made yourself a shulker farm which I plan on doing here in the near future as well. And we place those in that there, and they'll funnel down into that hopper, which will funnel down into the dispenser. Go ahead and grab whatever block it is you're, you're wanting to, to add here. We're just going to use some 
spruce planks. You're just going to add all those into that chest there. All right, once you've got that done, what you're going to do, you're going to come over here and you're going to push that button. Now, when you push that dispense and dis that button, that will dispense a shulker into place here and it will start loading it up for you. Now, once it's full, the comparator will detect that it's full and it will power the piston causing the piston to break the shulker and dispense it down into your chest down below so we'll go ahead and show you how that's going as you can see here that's starting to fill up and as we'll come over to this one here and you can see we've already got one already so we'll grab this one just to show you exactly look at there already full and you didn't have to mess with any of that stuff pretty slick don't you think I like that I like it a lot pretty neat and this is how we make a simple automatic shulker loader for Minecraft bedrock don't forget to like and subscribe check out all my videos bye now